Many Kentuckians have spent time in Haiti on mission trips, but despite the dangers of that country, they say the rewards of helping others and changing lives is worth it. A former WKYT reporter just returned from a mission trip to Haiti, and tonight she's talking to us about the experience. Monique Blair continues our team coverage from the live desk. Monique. Well, Amber, Wendy Enneking, a former WKYT reporter and now nurse practitioner who on Saturday came home from her first mission trip to Haiti. She says the rewards of traveling to a third world country far outweigh the risks. I like to think that I'm somebody who is very concerned about her safety and I never, ever once felt a concern there. Less than a week ago, Wendy Enneking came home from her first mission trip to the third world country. Although she describes Haiti as a place with overwhelming poverty, she says she never felt her safety was threatened. Children walking around, sometimes with no clothes on. There's no running water, there's no electricity for most Haitians. And these are things that most of us take for granted every single day. Um, so it was, it's very hard to describe until you see it. Anna King says there was security at the hotel she stayed, and although tragic, the incident where four people were shot last night in Haiti could have happened anywhere. The person who committed this act, um, you know, is having obviously has their own demons, and that that's not going to be the norm that they're going to encounter. Anna King says the shootings in Haiti will not deter her from taking another trip to the country, and she doesn't believe it will stop other missionaries from doing the same. I think it's going to motivate other missionary groups to keep up their work, not only in Haiti, but other countries where, you know, they're, they're at risk of, of violent attacks. And, you know, missionaries have been at risk since the beginning of time. Anna King's mission in Haiti was focused on home building, but because she is a nurse practitioner, she was able to provide some help with minor medical needs to the residents of Haiti. At the live desk, Monique Blair, WKYT. Monique, thank you. Anna King describes her trip to Haiti as very fulfilling, possibly even more so to the missionaries than the Haitian people.